Up, we're in the Jungle Tribe office today, and we're going to show you how to rock your blaster bag. We get a lot of emails about this kind of stuff, asking us how to wear it for like the main three ways that we have on, on our Etsy site. So, Justin is here. What's up, guys? And he's going to help me show you guys what to do. So, when you get this thing in the mail, or when you buy it from somewhere, you're going to open it up, and you're going to find that there's some straps inside. So, the first thing that you do is... Take the straps off. This is an X piece. This is going to be useful for the shoulder um, holster method. So the first one we're going to show you is just the regular method. You take the straps and you clip it onto the rings. That's pretty simple, right? This is the simplest way you can wear it. Throw your shoulder and then take off the leg strap and you've got yourself basically a purse to wear. So this is probably the easiest way. And you can also, if you want to keep a leg strap on, you can also hook it to your leg if you want to do it. You can shorten this if you want, pull it through, clip it back onto any of these clips, depending on you know how long you want it, how tall you are. So that's the first way. That's the first method there. Then the second one is going to be the shoulder. shoulder holster. This one's actually a little bit more difficult, so pay attention to this. So you need two people with, with this. What you're going to do is you're going to hold the bag underneath. You're going to get your helper to hold it underneath either the left or right side of the body. If you're right-handed, then you'll want to hold it on the other side as the zipper will be at the back. So I'm gonna just going to swing the around here. Okay. If you wear it this side then, and you're right-handed, then your arm can reach across your body and you can open up the zipper and get out what you need. So you're going to start like this and get your assistant to hold the bag for you. Then you're going to start at the front of the bag and pull it this on here. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to put it over the shoulder and then cross over the body. And then underneath the arm and then cross around till you've done a figure eight. You've got it like that. Now, in order to have it stay in the right position, you're going to pinch it at the back and you're going to use your trusty little cross piece to go across. There's a couple of snap settings, one that's really tight. This will hold it in place. You can use either one depending on how tight you want it. So if you want to really secure, you just snap it all together. It's tight as the leather is just fresh. So that will hold it in place. Now you can do whatever you want with the bag. You're ready to rock. So that's the second way of wearing it. Now for the hip method. Let's take this off. Start over again. So now for wearing it on hip, you just hold it right there and feed the clip through the big D-ring. You can either go through one or both of them, depending on how you want it to look. And you clip it onto the ring there, and you go around your body, and you put it on the back side. Depending on how tight you want to wear it, just slide it on. Now these little rings you can put over top of here if you want to pinch this leather down to have it a more flattened look. It all depends on how you want to wear it. Now we're going to throw the leg strap on. Let's just loosen that off a bit. Now we've clipped it on to the leg for the final look. So that's all those buttons that we have on our Etsy site. Um, obviously there's more ways you can wear them. Some of them have two leg straps. You can hook them all in place. You can get really creative with it. But I hope this helps you guys when you first get your bag.